So welcome everyone, this is uh, our E3 discussion podcast pilot thing, Majiki. That's the t- official title. Okay. Yeah, official uh, E3 discussion. Pi- discussion pilot thingy. Yeah, the, yeah. Okay. It, yeah. So are we still, you know, Surfer Dude 2121? Uh, we can. I was just saving that for gameplay, but I mean, this is kind of the pilot thing, so we can still go by that, or we could go by our names. We could go by both. That's a question. I'm... So we need an answer. Yes. What do you say, Gage? Uh, Negro. Oh, there goes the thing. <laughs> <laughs> we could just chop it off. Just do the well, surfer do then. Alright. Why? Well, what else could we do then? Well, he's just saying, do we want to go by our real names or do we want to go by our usual names that we, we usually do? Just names that we usually do. Okay, let's just... And let's what's, just, our, what's the names we usually do? Necrothine. Okay, okay, okay. We only go by two names. You're asking if there's a third? <laughs> no. <coughs> okay. This is a good start for our po- official, unofficial podcast. Yeah. Thingy. Yeah, so I wanted to discuss... E3 and I also wanted to try out the podcast just to see how it works and then also uh, this year especially it seems like it's all co-op games I don't know if you guys noticed that it's yeah I noticed it co-op yeah and last year was all single player right yeah well kinda single, well last year they launched the consoles that was all about with consoles and little yeah it was like games that should be counted as tech demo kind of things usually yeah, yeah. How it goes is they launch a console with some games, and those games suck all the time, every time. <laughs> so, yeah. And then this is what everyone's been waiting for is this year, now it's all, all the hardware stuff that's out of the way. Now we can just talk about games, games. and stuff. Yes. Uh, so the f- way I'm kind of thinking for this show is uh, we kind of discuss our gaming backgrounds a little bit just to say what we play on right now. Mm-hmm. Give our initial re- impressions going into A3, and then we'll go through... All at press conference. Kind of not go into detail too much. Like, I didn't get that much detail. We'll just give our Yeah, you didn't get any detail. <laughs> well, yeah. Because I watched it twice. All at press conferences. Well, I Excuse didn't me. even watch it once. I watched it, like, half. I just watched all the game trailers. Yeah. Yeah, in the wrong website. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Uh, I told him, I told uh, Necro to go to GameSpot.com and he went GameStop. I... I didn't really have that much time, and I wasn't really thinking. And, but well, it's better than last year, where you guys didn't watch anything. Uh, I watched last year. But GameStop did Xbox, have a lot of trailers, only. though. That's did have the only lot. thing I was interested in. Yeah, but there's more than that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, we'll go through all the games and all the shows. Kind of touched over it. There's some things that we know, and some <clears> things <throat> we don't know, like driving and dancing and other stuff. Hey, hey, hey. And then, uh, I know how to drive. Yeah. I know how to drive. I know how to drive too. And then and then Negro know how to, knows how to dance. Oh, yeah. yeah. And okay. then uh, at the very end, we'll kind of give our impressions and yeah. That's okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, so, uh, well, we'll start with uh, what we currently play with. Uh, I guess I should go last since I have the most stuff. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah. What, okay. What consoles and stuff? Uh, Negro goes first. Yeah. Okay, I have PS3, Xbox, and yeah. that's pretty much well. well which, which which Xbox? Xbox one? 360. Okay. I mean, the regular, the yes. original Xbox. Well, no, there's original Xbox. No, Xbox the original three. Xbox 360, the wait, white one. Wait, are okay. we talking about all the consoles that we have, or okay, it's just Xbox original, Xbox 360, Xbox One. This is the reason why I hate the Xbox name. You didn't so answer confusing. my question. What? Are we talking about the all the consoles that we own, or the consoles that we just play on right now? Let's just say the last few years, like last uh, two or three years. Last two or three years. Okay, so, it, okay, I mean, so, it's just you. It's, uh, it's, they're not saying Game Boy Advance. Basically, it's <laughs> PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360, PlayStation. and most of the time, sometimes I'll go back on PS2, I'll play some PS2 games, play some PS1 games, and mm-hmm. that's pretty much it. Okay. That, in the last two or three years that you played those PS1 games? Yeah, just from random. Okay. Best PS2 game? Uh, Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 3. I have just not saying. played that. You should. I, I've seen the box in Blockbuster. <laughs> no, I don't think it's there. Well, no. Blockbuster's gone. I'm just saying. I saw. Yeah, the that's box. why I don't think it's there. <laughs> I saw the box when it came out, and I'm like, oh. 
I'll run something else. That's a really good game. Just saying. Okay. Actually, I think I did run it. I don't know. I played one. I played one. One of them. Oh, it's Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi Three. It has to be that one because then it, then it just changes the control. Well, I, that's what I'm saying. I'm, I, I played a Dragon Ball game. I don't know which one because I know there's more than one. I'm just saying. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway. Mr. Fluss. Yes. What do you own? Um. Uh, hmm. Well, I have an Xbox 360, the white one, you know, the first Xbox 360. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then that one was going to die. It was breathing hard, so I was like, it's going to get a heart attack. When I say, like, soon. When I say, like, list your consoles, I mean just, like, just 360, not original 360 or new 360, R2D2 360. And <laughs> I have an R2D2 360. Okay. Which mm-hmm. fell, actually. Uh huh. It fell, I think, like, two, week- two days ago. Uh huh. Oh. I had the little plug and play connector thing to the controller and to the Xbox. Okay. Ra- wrap it up. Uh-oh. And one of my dogs. Uh-oh. One of my dogs <laughs> ran by. Okay. And Damn. You, you know, I'm trying to make this less than two hours of podcast. And I, I have an Xbox One. And that's it. And that's it. Well, and then also I gave you guys or lent or I gave you guys PCs or something. So you do have PCs. Well, does that count? We were only talking about consoles. It can. It counts as a console. Well, it's a gaming platform. Is what I'm asking. Yeah. And APC. And, yeah, PC that you play sometimes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I own a PS3, a Xbox 360, PC. You guys are giving me really <laughs> weird looks. He's wild. No, this is just the only thing I do, so I have a lot of stuff. Uh, 3DS, Nintendo, Wii, Wii U. Oh, wait, PC. I forgot. I have a 3DS too. You also have a Wii. And I also have a Wii. What the yeah. heck? So. Yeah. I'm a Game Boy Advance. Yay! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yes. Uh, Back to you. Yes. Uh, <clears throat> so I, basically I just don't own a three six or a Xbox One or a PS4. And that's about So that's all you need? That's all I need. Pretty much. Yeah. And his T. That's all he needs. And his T. Yeah, of course. course. That's not a great gaming no. platform. No, I'm actually out T right game. now. I could use no. T. Yeah. The T game. Brought to you by David. There's, there's pro- there's, oh, I said your name. There probably is a T game out there, somewhere. T-game. Probably somewhere. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Anyway, uh, so I was kind of uh, my expe- uh, expectations for the C three was kind of just big blockbuster games. Like they're probably gonna bring out every famous series from past generations and say it's on the new consoles generation. Go buy our consoles, kind of thing. That's what I was kind of expecting. You got you already have this game, but it's in a new console, so buy it again. That and just like new edition or the next game in the series of that game on the new console. Yeah, yeah. Was that kind of your guys' it, impressions going into it? Um, actually, did you even know there yes. was C three until I told you? No, I knew about it. Okay. I think because I'm I'm a little bit more connected with. I kind of forgot. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know about it last year, yeah. but then you forgot. Mm, I forgot. It's, it happens every year. I don't know if you caught that. Yeah, yeah, yeah I forgot. Okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> so uh, the first uh, press conference was Xbox. Uh, so, I don't know if, when you, well, we both saw the press conference. I watched it uh, at work. Ah. That's yeah. pl- the best pl- place to watch it. Yeah. Um, okay, so I have my workstation. I yeah. have two monitors, right? Uh-huh. Yeah. So I had a little, like, half of my... Half of one monitor was full with the video. Yeah. And the other what I was working on. and Well, working on quotes. Yeah. Because I wasn't working. Yeah. <laughs> right. I was watching it. Yeah. Could you get in trouble for that, or...? Well, nobody sees me. No. Oh. I guess that's good. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Because I'm like in a little, little, little office, so. Yeah. Is it like a cubby or is it an actual office? No, it's a little office. Okay, go back to E3. It's like a closet. Let's go back to E3. Focus. <laughs> Kissing. So, uh, Phil Spencer, the new ex- head of Xbox. What do you guys say? Yeah, yeah. Impressions of, ex- uh, of Phil Spencer. I mean, he supposedly is making the Xbox just about games and not about TV, like they said 500 times last time. Because... Yeah. yeah, so, uh, I mean, I know Mr. Fluss is an Xbox elitist and fanboy, so yeah, he's yeah, going to yeah. disagree, but Xbox was pretty much 
really bad last year, and... Was, and now with all the games, they got better? It, it, they turned it around. They backtracked a lot from... It's yeah. pretty much a, the complete opposite of what they announced last year, so everyone was waiting the for... The thing is, people were not ready for it. I don't think they were wor- ready for it. I don't... Th- I think there was also a lot of problems with it. Like, the things they were trying to enforce on us yeah, weren't the, the best Yeah, they way. weren't ready for it. No, not, some things weren't too great, like in terms of the uh, digital things and stuff. It, there's there's problems, underlying problems. But, yeah, I don't think we we're ready just yet for the digital age where everything's online. We're getting there, but we're not... <laughs> I don't think we're just Are you ready, Necro? I'm ready. Okay, so Are just... you ready, Surfer? Yeah. So, yeah. also, yeah. <laughs> the first thing I noticed when they uh, zoomed out to the audience is, I don't know if you noticed, but everyone The had, bracelets. Yeah, the bracelets. Yes. Dude, that was awesome. Do you awesome. know why they gave everyone, like, bracelets? No, but I know, like, for every game or you know, kind of, like, atmosphere, it's set to the atmosphere. That was the thing the they came out with. The real reason... Last year, they pumped in audience clapping when no one was clapping. So they got in trouble for that last year. So that's why this year, it's like clap bracelet. So everyone claps. You get to see them actually clapping instead of oh. clapping, quote, unquote. So that that was the first thing I was laughing at. I'm like, really? They were that... They really wanted to show that that much? I mean, they could just zoom in really closely at someone's hands. <laughs> But yeah, that was the first thing I noticed. I, 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 I did like them though. Like I yeah. wanted one of those. Like, well, of course, I want one of those. Of course, you have like five hundred bands all the time. <laughs> it's only two, but okay. Well, there was more. One time you had like ten or so on your phone at once. I was probably playing around. Yeah, yeah. So the first game that came out came out with was Call of Duty: Advanced Warfare. Yes, <sighs> I did see that. Right. I am getting it. You yes. getting it? Okay. I am getting this it. This one looks really interesting with all the technology I saw. It's it. not present day anymore. No, yeah, no, no. That's why it's advanced warfare. So this yeah. has to be. I don't know. I liked how I like the grenades. Y- yes, yeah, the grenades were the, interesting. The grenades, right? Grenades. Yeah. I know, like I know I'm going to die flipping through all the things. So <laughs> that's one thing I'm gonna notice. Like, I'm oh, not, so you're like switch. No, no, not that grenade. This one. Yeah. <laughs> the one thing I did like though were the uh, drones. They look menacing. You mean the things from the Matrix? Oh yeah. Those things that fly around. And... Did you notice it was from the Matrix? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's, that's what I saw too. Like, like wait, like, where's that from? Like, yeah. <laughs> But now you have to get like a car door just to protect yourself from those yeah. things coming. Yeah, I, I don't think the car door is gonna do anything. I I don't know, but that's what you know, uh, like they got. But 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 it's like the most. Just grab thing. a human. Uh, shield me. Also, like I noticed that they had these walking tank type you mean things. The spider tank. Yeah, like the spider tank thing. Spider and tank. It almost kind of spider reminds tank. me like of something from a Star Wars, you know, type of. Oh film, yeah. Like, well, have you noticed every sci-fi game movie it has a, yeah, spider has tank now? Else. Yeah, like has... Watch like Watch Dogs just came out and they actually have a spider tank in there. Like it's they a, do. It's a weird. Who does? Yeah, uh, Watch Dogs. There's like a the acid trip thing you could do, and you get to be a spire tank. But we we're gonna do a let's play on that later on. You know, okay. I, I saw it's it's too buggy to play right now, so I have to wait. Yeah. Oh, it is. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I played the acid trip story. part with um like flowers. You're oh. jumping on flowers. Oh yeah, yeah. That, yeah. It, it's basically one of those. But, but you're a uh, you're a spire tank, and it's a lot of fun. You get to crush cars and kill nice. cops and stuff. Necker has no idea what we're talking about. No. <laughs> no, I do. Okay. Like a neighbor of mine got the game and he brought it over. Like, okay, play, okay. Uh, so, uh, did you notice how there was time fault in the Call of Duty with the double jump? Yes, I do like the, t- t- the yes. double jump coming back. I do like that. Oh yeah, aspect. yeah, I did notice that coming back. Well, like there was like a lot of games in the nineties and such, and then they took it out, and then. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I like the double jump. Yeah, uh, I do like the vertical Cali, and a lot of people were expecting it to be in Call of Duty, and then it showed up in Call of Duty, and it was like. Okay. Yeah. So, because yeah. I mean, Call of Duty tends to stay more realistic, where Halo is more like. Sci-fi. They kind of re- uh, left yeah. the re- realm of real- realistic when they came out with Spire Tanks and Matrix robots. So, yeah. Which was in Call of Duty: Advanced Warfare. Yes. So the next one after that was Forza Five or Forza Horizon Two. You know. So I pretty much spoilers. I just pretty much skipped anything sport or car or really dancing. I mean, I stuck I stuck around until they drove. They mentioned Drivatar, and then I tuned out after that. I mean, it played on. But Drivatar. It's where it's like your ghost AI character. Oh. It's your driver AR called Drivatar. Oh, is that the one like where it learns from you and it kind of yeah does that? Yeah, that's kind of yeah. cool. It's interesting, but uh, 
I, 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 I don't really care for racing games. I don't care for sports games or stuff. You know, I played one, I get them all. Is is the camp I play in. <laughs> I feel like there haven't been any good racing games these long time. last years. The last yeah. racing game I liked was Need for Speed Carbon. And then there's also You know, like the one Mario I played Carbon. was Need for Speed Most Wanted. That one I tried that, but game. I didn't like it because you couldn't customize anything. You couldn't customize uh, very little, yeah. yeah. But the cop chases were awesome. Yeah, they were good, and then they, they got bored after the fifth time we did it, and then, yeah. I guess no, no, I didn't get bored of it. No. Okay, no. Well, maybe you have, well, you also play fighting games and such, so yeah. you're probably you're that feel of gaming that I don't really spend time with. I, I play it not as much, but yeah, it's still yeah. a change of pace. I mean, they're pretty. It's a car porn. Pretty. Car porn game is car porn. Yeah, that's what everyone calls it. Car porn. Car, car porn. porn. I like it's that. It's all HD and all nice looking. Car porn. You know, never... <laughs> the door opens sideways. <laughs> <laughs> Are you healing that ne- necro? <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, so. Thank God. Yes. Okay. Moving on. Moving on. Oh no! I can't stop it. Okay, go ahead. Moving on, evolve. What was that? <laughs> yes. The next game. Yes. 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 So definitely. Yes. That's, that's a thousand times yes. That's like uh, my top two yes. right now. Okay. Well, uh, I do want to say, uh, I don't know if I mentioned this before, but we're also going to discuss during this games that we're going to do Let's Plays in, because since it's all mostly mo- co- uh, co-op, yes. we should kind of decide it. We'll talk about it as we go, and then we'll kind of make a list, and then we'll decide, we, because we can't get every game, but we can get... I the top could. five. Well, yeah, you guys could. I can mm. afford every game, once a game per month kind of thing. No, you have to play it good. Look, you tell your dad you want this game. You tell your sister you want this game for Christmas. Uh-huh. For Christmas. And then you tell Gage, Negro, I want this game. Uh-huh. And then you tell, I don't know, uh-huh. any uncles you have or something, I want this game. Mm-hmm. But don't you, tell him. And then, I, no. And then you get all the games. Yeah. Uh, uh, that doesn't quite work for my family. Okay. Like me, okay. last, last Christmas. Okay, back to Evolve. I gifted okay, so. my brother Call of Duty, but it was actually What funny. I found in okay. the trailer was pretty much when you're playing the monster, I guess if you attack certain things, like like a plant, then you then you're, the monster like evolves. Yeah, as you spikes. do more damage. I didn't and, see that. Yeah, didn't as see you that? do more damage and stuff to the environment and to the players, you... Get yeah. bigger and better and get more upgrades. It's oh, kind of so like the tank in Left 4 Dead. This, this is also the same people that made Left 4 Dead, so it kind of has that vibe. But also, yeah. uh, I don't know if you saw, like, there was, like, one character I'm really interested in, and you play it as, like, a robot or something, but you the ro- each class or character has, like, it's, like, each there's, like, four classes, and then there's, like, two sub classes of that class so it's classception kind of thing classception so but there's like this robot and he has like a special ability where you can take his head off and throw in the air and then you can scout the area around for the players or something but then well, yeah it's like but your body's vulnerable like it just stands there so oh that, that's kind of so, the, the take back pros and cons yeah uh there's <clears> like <throat> other players where you can set like a bubble dome to trap the monster when you find it there's other i did see that you yeah, could like do like tr- uh set turns or traps or something so there was one guy that's like very interesting too. i put this on the game list to play and get to definitely play yeah to do let's play let's play list hmm. of things to do yeah. hmm. uh so yeah that's all i have to say uh next game that i was really surprised about i mean i, I knew about the game that's how creed unity yeah before because it came out it actually got leaked in a very weird way someone just mentioned it on the airplane and just bragged about it and then they someone went on YouTube and just told everyone so uh, but the thing I was surprised about is co-op and single yes. player yeah that yeah, was I ever since they came out with multiplayer in Assassin's Creed I always wanted co-op in the single player but uh, what, what are you guys impressions about Assassin's Creed you know I mean Louise or I, sh- Plus? I, sh- I should just say I like it <laughs> okay <laughs> Review over. <laughs> That's your review. That's my review. <laughs> Do you want to continue or no? I mean, wait, wait, wait. no. I mean, wait, yes. Uh, you well, I played all the Assassin's Creed games. I played. Um, okay, I think you I stopped. Don't, at... I don't know which one it is, but it's the part where the guy kills the chick. Spoilers. <laughs> well, it can't be a spoiler. I mean, yeah. Well, yeah. okay. Well, he, he is no. Well, anyway. Oh. Anyway. Oh, Negro, <laughs> you did not just hear that. No. Well, you oh, kill, we, like, we, chick, we, a chick dies. We don't. Yeah. Know. Okay. okay. Anyway. What? Anyway, nothing. It's uh, uh, I think Barhood. 
think so. Yeah, yeah. it's Brotherhood. So yeah. you stopped on Brotherhood. You haven't done any Assassin's Creed. Yeah, which which I was going to explain. Like, I haven't really played any of the Assassin's Creed, but this <laughs> one... Yes. This one looked really cool just because, it, you know, kind of reminded me of, uh, uh, like, Payday. You know, each, each uh, like, character, f- uh, like, from what I saw, has a certain, uh, like, ability. You know, like they were saying that one person can go, you know, in the one area and then the other guy could, mm-hmm. uh, you know, like, uh, like unlock doors or like you know do stuff like that yeah like which i thought was you know cool okay you know i i do have more well i guess i go into now so they did um after the show like after all the shows they uh on the show floor they talked a little bit more about the co-op uh there was a little bit of controversy how there was no female character and they were like hey how come we couldn't have a custom female character that we could choose like an option add on well yeah they Yes. But they for fifty bucks. So, <laughs> so they uh, came out and said, uh, "We didn't have time. We or the production amount of money and time and to make a female model and get the voice and animated and everything." And like, and then like a, someone that used to work at Ubisoft and kind of said, "Yeah, that's not true. They could do it in a day or two. And so, so but what's so the reason? so they and then they, no then they came out with the actual reason that actually makes sense." So, um, you guys didn't play Watch Dogs, but uh, in Watch Dogs, you can do, like, a multiplayer hacking game where you, as uh, the main character, go into someone else's world and hack them. But on your view, you are hacking a citizen, and but on their view, they're playing as the main character, but and you are represented as a random civilian. So, right. you are always... So, everyone is always the main character on their view, but everyone else is a citizen on... Um, when you're looking at everyone else. Okay. That's the same thing in this. The main character in the Assassin's Creed Unity is called Arno. Also, um, Assassin's Creed Unity takes place in Revolutionary France, which is an awesome time period. A lot of death and corruption. And, and revolution. Gu- revolution and guillotine and lots of crazy stuff happened in that yeah, time. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So, it should be interesting. I'm Ran definitely getting it. Yeah. So, at you play as Arno. So, player one or you are playing as Arnold, and then you see the other assassins, but the other assassins play as Arnold too. So it's oh. going to be very interesting of coronation because you can't really say, hey, Arnold, go to this point because you're all Arnold. So, <laughs> Arnold 1, go over there. Yeah. Arnold 2. You do also, something else. Uh, well, you guys don't know about the stealth mechanics in co op, but it's very hard to do anything stealth. So. Because as soon as someone messes up, everyone yeah. messes up. <coughs> someone can, can, can I just do that? Well, it's called uh, like there's a, this old thing in WoW uh, called Roscoe Jenkins or or something. I, I, I think I'm messing up, but they it, it's like a famous YouTube video where someone just charges in and like he was in a group of like 30 or so, and so oh. aggroed everyone <laughs> and then they all died when they were like healing and stuff. So hmm. he just goes, he charges in, going Roscoe Jenkins, and then. Yeah, I'll show it later. But yeah, I am people. very interested uh, in doing co-op and stuff. So I, I think I might definitely get it too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, also, uh, another question is, uh, if we do co-op and stuff, we might, we're might we going to probably have to do PC because if we do Let's Plays and stuff. So that's one thing. And yeah. most of these co-op things are coming on PC. Uh, we are going to take a break after the Xbox thing, Necro. I do see... It's getting a little bit hot in here. here. It is getting a little bit stuffy in here. Uh, we'll break and get drinks and beer and stuff. Uh, we we'll, we'll go a little bit quicker because we're only on number three or four. Yeah. Uh, so next one is Dragon Age In- Inquisition. That's the one with the dragons. <clears throat> uh, that's the first. Yeah, well, no, Dragon Age Inquisition. Hmm. No, that's, <laughs> not, that's the first game of dragons. There's actually two games of dragons or three, I think. You'll, we'll talk about it later. Okay. Uh, so, does, did anyone play Dragon Age? No. 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 It was on the games of to play since I played Mass Effect and like last Ma- Mass Effect, but I heard two wasn't that great. First one was good, or maybe it's the other way around. I don't know. Point is, I haven't played it. I didn't really understand what was going on screen. It looked interesting. It looked colorful. It looked pretty. Might be Scarlet. Pretty. It looked like uh, Sky, uh, Skyrim. Yeah. That's basically it. That's my review. <laughs> Moving on. Okay. <laughs> uh, what is that your review too? Um, you know, 
I never really liked RPGs. Mm. I mean, I'll do them, but yeah. I just don't like, you know, just taking an hour to do one mission or something. Well, I mean, we did play... I played Mass Effect, yeah. and we played... Uh, that was a very stream. stream What's that one other game? I don't understand this. Ah, uh, the one with the chick and the powers and the... Remember me? No. The Tomb chick and the powers? No. Oh my god, we just did a let's play of it. And we did not finish it, by the way. We still have to do. Finish game one and game two. Border I can't. Oh my god. Borderlands? Yes! Oh, that one! Borderlands. The one that we spent like 40 plus hours playing? Uh -huh, and I cannot remember the name. Yes. That okay. one. That one. Oh. And that one's uh, similar, but I mean, that one's fun. Um, I don't know. That one's no, fun. No, yeah. You're. That one's a little. It's different, right? There's. Some games where I can direct you that are open world, but are like that where they are fun and doesn't take an hour to get there. Yeah. Skyrim is actually one of those. Surprisingly. Really? Yeah. It's even you can go take an hour to get there, like walk on foot, or you can just fast travel to the entrance and just do the cave. Yeah. It's a, it's pretty it's pretty good. It's got like game of the year like twice already or something. Huh. So, I don't know. Game of the year like twice? Yeah, it came out twice. How did that happen? It, oh, it came out twice. Well, technically. It, oh. Yeah. Like, anyway, we'll it, launch it again, just yeah, because. Yeah. Uh, Sunset Overdrive is the next one. Okay. I This is by the same people that made Ratchet & Clank games. I'm getting I, it. I love this game. Yes. Uh, I thought the trailer was creative, how they did like yep. the army soldier on the box. I thought it was, oh, was going to be yep. an Call of Duty. And then it was like, yep. guy comes through the door, not shooting everyone. I'm like, like okay. I like why are you so serious? I mean, I liked, the, I liked the E3 trailer last year. I'm very sad it's only an Xbox One exclusive. That's the only thing I'm saying. Is that the one where it was kind of like goofy, like where there was almost yes. like these zombies yes. and then the last okay, part the of the guy puts this soda can? Yes. <laughs> so the, the zombie Is that it? Yeah. Then we're infected okay. by this energy so, drink. So the zombies are, are, they were people, and then they got turned into, quote, zombies by drinking this infectious energy drink. And, but then also the energy drink also powers weapons and other stuff, and... Mm -hmm. I the thing I like most is I don't know if you noticed it but when you like shoot someone and the blood goes splat or if you do an explosion the smoke spells boom it's like little <laughs> oh thing, you yeah can, it's like little it's kind of like, like yeah, um Deadpool ish Deadpool comic ish yeah, like goofy yeah, yeah it's yeah. like it's uh, slapstick stuff I'm very interested in it look the gameplay I was a little bit torn off about it looked a little bit weird I do like how the, like they slide it like if they no this not the sliding right but like the like the guy like smashed the camera to push it back. And push it was like breaking the fourth floor kind of thing. Oh, I I did like that. I mean, I I like Deadpool. Did that had a lot. Which of was also kind of like that. Yeah. So anyway, that was my impression. You guys, uh, I think one million one hundred nine thousand. I think that is also. I think the game is also co-op too. But then, oh yeah. Yeah, but we also need all, uh, well, two more Xbox ones, to play to play it to, or we could just do like a passenger tour thing, but if we did want to do co-op. Because it's like an open world cop thing, RPG, MMO thing. It's like that drop in, drop out online yeah, yeah, cop yeah. co thing that's hot right now, and like Destiny or something that we're gonna talk about later. Uh, let's move on. Wait, I want to say it. What? So our next game is Dead Rising Three Super Ultra Arcade Remix Cyber Edition X Plus Alpha. <laughs> yes. And that is the official ah! title of the actual game. That's like the best. <laughs> I know. That's the best. <laughs> I thought title. it was a joke at first when yeah. I saw. That. Yeah. Because I kind of wrote my notes funny because it was just notes for me, but yeah. <laughs> but no, uh, it's anyway. But it's an add-on, right? It is. Yeah, it's an add-on to Dead Rising Three. Yeah. You should actually play Dead Rising Three. It's that's it's like that. Dead, it's like Deadpool. It's slapstick. It's funny. Hmm. Uh, Dead Rising Three is actually a little bit more serious. So. Oh, okay. Yeah. I mean, you played Dead Rising Two with me. It's it's more action packed than Dead Rising Two. Okay. Okay. It. So. We can do let's play, it. and then you can. Do go off on it and tell us how good it is and rub it in their faces. Okay, hey, I like how the Xbox One has the the Twitch thing. Yeah, it's all it's yeah that came out a few months ago now. I don't know. Yeah, anyway. but like randomly, I'm playing a game and then it just says video clip recorded. Oh, that no, that's not Twitch. It is. Oh well, I don't it, know what it is. It's the video playback. Uh, that's something. Uh, the vi it record if you get an achievement, you probably got an achievement at the time, right? Oh, is that when it records it? Yeah, it records your achievements. Ah. So it's yeah. Also, you do uh, you can say 
uh, Xbox, and then uh, record this. I think, yeah, yeah, some of the, yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't want to say those two words at the same time in case our viewers are having Xbox around them, because we you can. Oh, well, they can record us. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. 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 Uh, I'll, but yeah, uh, it looks like a lot of fun. I don't have an Xbox One, so I can't do Dead Rising Three. So tier, tier, tier. I don't have money. Uh, Dance, Here. so they spent like five minutes, uh, talking about that, de- that de- they're still working on Dance Central and Fantasia. Eh. 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 I mean. Yeah. I mean, oh, that's really eh. interesting. No. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. Uh, yes, it's, yes, please. It's, it's getting hot, so we need to move on. Uh, Fable Legends. I, it, I played all the Fable games so mm-hmm, far. Mm-hmm, I mm-hmm. came in at Fable 3 and then went back and played all the Fable games. Mm-hmm. I liked it, all the Fable games, and this is interesting. Like, it's supposedly, it's four-player co-op, and you all pick, it's kind of like uh, Team Fortress in a way. You all pick, like, a silly class or something, and then you uh, face off another human player that plays the villains and places traps and mobs and stuff to fight, and that's basically the game. I mean, there's probably going to be more uh, as it goes. I mean, it's very early in the development cycle, but yeah. What are your thoughts? Uh, Have you guys played Fable at all? Well, yeah. Didn't we play one? Yeah, we played the. Uh, uh, yeah, so that we, was the one we. Yeah, played we did play. Right? We did play uh, Fable One HD. Yeah. But uh, yeah. I'm talking about like, have you guys ever played gone it? on and gone played? on and played or completed no. a Fable game? No. no. Okay. I just played maybe a couple hours. Well, of- what is your impressions of this gameplay where it's like four player? Well, it's kind of like Evolve too. It's kind of going with that thing where one person's the monster and the other four people are trying to kill that. And this one? Yeah, it's the same thing. It's oh. like dungeon rating where you try to get to the end and someone else is trying to stop the other players, the heroes. So it's that kind of thing. So, I mean, you like Evolve, so I'm guessing you like that. So, gameplay. So, okay. We'll, we'll, we'll check it well, out later. I'll have to check it out. We'll ch- I think that. most of these games are coming out in 2015. There's only a few that are coming out 2014. Mm. So, we, ha- we have time to discuss and look and watch videos and stuff. Uh, Project Spark. Which one's that one again? I that, did like this. It it it, it kind of reminded me of like a Ratchet and Clank type of game. That what you saw was all pre-rendered. Uh, it was all ne- pre-rendered. Okay. Yeah. You, Necro has a hard time distinguishing yeah. <laughs> pre-rendered from actual gameplay. Uh, that is also co- one thing I did notice. A lot of this stuff is really early alpha or pre-rendered stuff. Not a lot. Of, not a whole lot of gameplay hmm. that I saw, yeah. in, like across E3. So. Well, at least in the press conferences. Which, uh, one's, which one's this one, though? This one is... It. It's like an Xbox Connect game thing where you can, like, tell your Connect to make a game for you. It's... Uh, have you guys seen Little Big Plant? Yeah. It's kind of like that, where you make your own levels and then you invite friends to play your levels. and It's a little bit more robust. It's like... It's not 2D size scroll. It's 3D. Uh, it's very early alpha right now. Like, really early. They just mm. put an alpha out for the Xbox... Actually, it's uh, Windows 8 right now because they're trying to sell Windows 8. So if you have Windows 8... You can... Windows 8 sucks. Yeah, so that's why no one's playing it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so uh, we, we'll check out later. All right, so the next game on the list is... I, f- I lost my place. Um, Ori in the Blind Forest. Oh, yeah, this one. This one I was interested in. I think Mr. Fluss has something he wants to say. Do you know which one we're talking about? You, the, you, you watched the press conference, right? Yeah. Okay, I'm trying to remember which one this was. This one was see. the little white cat thing. Yes. 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 <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh, white cat? it's so sad. The, it's sad, though. Yeah. I was That's like, That's theme ah, for this E3. It's why? lots of sad trailers. So, uh. Do you know which one it is? No, like, I, it's, I think I, I saw it. No, I, I'm, pretty sure, I'm pretty sure you saw it. Oh, he, he didn't watch the press. Well, he, yeah. Well, I did watch. Okay, let me look at the trailers. Yes. yes Ms. Wanted... Fluss, why don't you tell it while I look up the image? Okay. Describe it. Just like yeah, okay. Uh, why was it sad? It was sad because it seems like he's kind of like a bear. Okay. Well, okay. Well, started off first. A white cat get fall out of the sky and landed, and then something found it. What found it, though? Yeah. Just. Go on. I'm saying. I think it was describe like... Describe what happened... What Describe the trailer to Necro while I'm finding it. He's yeah. looking at me. Necro's waiting. So I guess we're waiting for my trailer. Yeah. Do you want me not to look at you? 
Don't look at me, please. Okay, tell me. I'm not looking. Okay, we'll be back after a short break. After we show Necro this video. Okay. Wow. That actually was kind of sad. Yeah. It uh, was really sad. It's very colorful. It has. It's the same kind of art style that, like, Raymond it's my Orr. kind of game. Just saying. Well, yeah. It's, yeah it's, it. If it's colorful, it's Mr. Fluss's game. Yes. And if, and if it has cute game. things, it's kind of my yeah. thing. Yeah. yeah. It, it so has like, the art style from like Rayman Origins. That kind of uh, um, watercolored the, kind of look. The white cat reminds me uh, reminds me of the uh, the little pixie cat flying thing from um, Dust. The oh, game, yeah. remember? Yeah. The yellow orangey ish yeah, one. I want to go out. I, I don't know if this is right, but it, I think this is the same studio that made that game, The Dust Racing oh. Tale. I don't know for sure because that was made by one man in over like seven years or so. And Dust? Uh, yeah. Wow. Yeah. It, uh, he was. Good in, job, man. He was in uh, any game, the movie. That's another game movie that I need to watch, but yeah. <laughs> anyway, uh, moving on because I'm dying. Yeah, we're still very. Not even, uh, for this. Alright, so, uh, well, you guys didn't really say much about the game, uh, Ori and the Blind Forest. What do you guys think of it? It's, or, it's powerful, I mean, just with the story and... I know, right? Yeah. You know, Kitten falls down or, like, whatever it is. Yeah, yeah it seems like, I Some guess, sort of the owl, thing. um, somehow kills the... Yeah. Uh, the little... Want to be like, Kung Fu Panda? Yeah. I kind of want to see more gameplay. I did, we saw a little bit of glimpses. A little bit, yeah. But again, I think the cat just goes somewhere. I think it's like Rayman platforming kind of thing. Yeah, that's all I got. But, yeah, because it takes um, its like revenge on the uh, like owl. Like I'm I, don't, yeah. this. I don't think it takes revenge. I think it just does, <coughs> does something does to stuff. help his friend. I don't know. Or yeah, anyway, but yeah, or maybe that's what it's doing. Is that gonna be like an indie game or a full blown game? I think that's like. In that category of it's a full blown game, but it's art like an arcade game. Arcade game, so like thirty ish Arc- price, maybe. It's like in that category with like Bastion. You know, it's a full fledged game that's very polished. Plants vs. Gardens. No, I mean, a, Plants vs. Zombies. <laughs> that's a triple A. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Well, the shooter one. I don't know about the mobile. Yeah, the shooter one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, yes, I will. Think uh, on the list of things I need to watch more later. I'm interested in. That's that where, one. Yeah, the Ori and the Blind Forest. Mm-hmm. That's where I am. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the next one, the one that we all predicted yes. on and waited for, Halo Collector or Col- uh, Master F- Chief Collection is. I was gonna say F- Halo Five, but that's next year. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, impressions, because I talk too much. Okay. First off, I never played Halo Two. Yes. So this is my chance. Yes. So it's definitely so, we'll get. Yeah, it. they did completely remake the did the whole anniversary thing. Yeah, yeah. But they also went one step further and remade the cutscenes of all Halo Two, so they polished those even more. Nice. Than the original one, so or Halo Anniversary, well Halo Anniversary CE. So, uh, yeah, uh, continue on with your impressions. So also um. They're keeping the original multiplayer from Halo 2, nice. I heard. Yes, that's the and one. And I that... heard that's one of the best multiplayers from Halo. Yeah, that's why I hear too. Correct. Yeah. So, so they're going so they're going it's four games, Halo 1, 2, 3 and 4. Yes. Uh over 100 multiplayer maps. So I'm guessing yes. all three or Halo 3 with map... all the DLCs yes. ever. All of them. Yes. All the campaign missions. Yes. yes. All in one disc. Yes. Have wow. you guys uh, well before oh. I say uh, my next thing, Necro, what do you think of this? What are your thoughts? I didn't really see the full trailer for that, but like I did see that they were combining all the games together. You don't really need to see a trailer that's already been came out. No, so yeah, this, it, it, like it wasn't a trailer. It was just, just this is what's gonna just happen. Just think Halo Four graphics with Halo Two. Yeah, that's that's yeah, what I'm saying. Basically. Like that's yeah. all I I like really yeah. saw. I mean, yeah. I didn't see really in depth. Well, they also like show like a little bit of glimpses of their. Uh, TV show or episode web TV show. Uh, oh, what's it called? Nightfall. Uh, yeah, yeah, that one. Yeah, Nightfall. Nightfall. Yeah, yeah. and then it's going to be a series. Yeah, it's a series. Yeah, uh, if you buy the collectors, or I'm just going to call it collector's edition because it's easier to say. Okay, that. okay, <laughs> let's do that then. Uh, they're also going to have the Halo Five beta. Uh, but yeah, that is another reason that. why it's pretty good. But yeah. also, uh, but yeah, if you buy the game, you get I don't know. if I know you get the first episode for free, 
I don't know. I think if you also you also get the rest of the episodes, I'm not 100 like sure on that. Full first season, perhaps. I think there's only gonna be one season because uh, Nightfall oh. is the series that's gonna carry you to Halo Five. Right. It fills yeah, that's in what that, I heard too. That fills in that gap, and then the other TV show fills in between Halo Three and Halo Four. The Steven Spielberg show, movie thing they're doing. Oh, I didn't. That was announced last year. Cricket, oh, cricket. okay. <laughs> yeah. So. Uh, but yeah. Oh, I I good. wonder what the price range is going to be for it though. Do you guys know the price range because they announced it? Oh, they did. Yes. Well, I was guessing somewhere around like one hundred dollars. One hundred dollars for Mister Flux. What do you say, Necro? I'll just say fifty. Fifty. No. What? I don't know. No. 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 Make a guess. No. Get out. Get out. <sighs> one hundred twenty. One hundred twenty. Okay. One hundred twenty for Necro. One hundred for me. Sixty dollars. For all four games. No way. Sixty dollars, best deal ever. Oh wow! Yes. And I said fifty, and you. you and I. <laughs> geez. I was like, is I beat gonna you. Win? <laughs> That's the price really, right. That's really Mr. good. Just come on down. You win. Da, what do I win? Da, 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 you won. I trip out of this room, but we'll do that in like five minutes or so. Okay. Ten minutes or twenty minutes. I don't know. That's Hello. really good. That is really good. That is really good. But you also need a. It's only Xbox One though. So you, I have an Xbox One. We don't have Xbox One. Uh, well, sucks for you guys. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, so yeah, you, that's one thing. Uh, I guess that's the thing they were counting on to oh push my. push the Xbox One because Xbox One, not selling that well. Shocker. Yeah. It, PS4 is kind yeah. of beating them quite a bit. Yeah. Like in the millions. Yeah. Yep. No, not in, Whoa, yeah. You, you, no, like, yeah. it's a, like a million. It's, it's like, what the heck? It's, don't hit the mic. <laughs> I wasn't trying to. No, it's they d- haven't announced it, but it's but yeah, pretty but yeah, big yeah, it, gap. It's, Let's just yeah, agree yeah, on that. Yeah, Let's, yeah. Anyway, yeah. Uh, moving on. Uh, inside, uh, they kind of gave it away with the T-shirt mm. th- with the developers that made Limbo. It said Phil Spencer came out with a big shirt that said Limbo, and it's like this developer that we're not gonna name just yet, and it's like. Limbo. I wonder Limbo. if it's Limbo. Oh. Real, uh, do you guys remember Limbo? Uh, or have you played it? It's uh, kind of the shadow game where the boy is running from left to right. And there, there's a he, crowd he, thing. He's dark, right? It's all black and white. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. I, said. Uh, I think I it's got it. It's like 2D pla- uh, paper looking thing. Yeah. It's really old. It, made, it sold a lot of copies. A lot of copies. It's yeah. on every platform. I actually think I played it. I think I, think I own it, maybe. I think I own it, too. Yeah. Somewhere. Uh, so this is the same people. It looks really interesting. It's the same kind of premise of like 2D, uh, 2D uh, going from left to right platformer thing, but it's now 3D and three dimensional. So there's like mm-hmm. background. And is stuff. that the one where it's still like a kid? And it's a boy kid. running, and then there's like a city that's like oppressed, and then yeah, like it kind of reminded me of uh, just like a dictatorship, and you know things yeah. are going, you know. Wrong, and then this kid's just trying to escape. You know, yeah. that, that's what it. I mean, it's kind, kind of, of the opposite. Where we saw gameplay, but I don't know the story, so I'm kind of interested. So, yeah. oh, yeah, it's kind of the opposite. That's the only one, though. <laughs> uh, and then they came out with a whole bunch of indie games. That kind of montage thing. I didn't really get. I seen a lot of them on like Steam and stuff. So they're coming from Xbox One. Okay, there's one that everyone's oh. liking. It's called Cuphead. Uh, you probably saw it. It was like the rubber hose cartoony look. Came off for like three seconds or so. Like, do you remember like the old Mickey Mouse cartoons? You know, like it was like the rubber hose kind of thing. Mm-hmm. And they're basically using that art style and making the game. Yeah, I think I remember I could probably that. put it on a trailer. Probably. Uh, but yeah, there was like tons of games and stuff uh, from there. A lot of it, like, like I said, a lot of them are on Steam, but... Uh, it's cup. Yeah, it's cup. Uh, it's cup. The cup. another one that. Qua 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 qua. Yeah, the other one. Cup song. Well, while I'm looking this up, uh, the next one that I was really excited for, Rise of the Tomb Raider. Yes. I love the first one or the last brief vamp. So Tomb this Raider. is like where it like, takes place after yeah. where she killed like 500 million people on yeah. the island. And and now the yeah, psychology so she's like is traumatized. Yeah. <laughs> psychology is hitting in. Yeah. But yeah, uh, impressions of what you thought of Tomb Raider. Yeah, like I definitely like this one. You know, this is where she finally just kind of, you know, before she, she was cuckoo. more like a, yeah, well, no, no, she was, 
you know, like an like an innocent person, pretty much just looking for adventure. And then in this one, this is where you know she starts to change mm-hmm. her viewpoint. I will say, uh, I, I felt bad pushing her for the game. Yeah, <laughs> it got yeah. dark a little bit a few times. I'm like, I don't want to play. Anymore. I never fit, uh, actually played the whole thing for that one. Well, uh, I know me and Necro played. Yeah, Let's play I, I was there too for like maybe two, three episodes. You played like the last episode, and then we left there. Or <laughs> just one or two episodes. Then yeah. <laughs> anyway, uh, so yeah, going back to Cuphead. This is Cuphead. Uh, I'll mute it, but uh, yeah, it looks interesting. It's taking that rubber hose kind of style. Oh, I know you're talking about like the, it's like a Disney type thing. Yeah. Pew, 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 pew. Again, I don't know the story. I don't know. I mean, it's it's yeah, never been it, done it, before. It's new. I'm it has like a steamboat willy type of. Uh, yeah, it's all, look supposedly to on it. Steam too. So maybe we'll check that out in the future Let's Play or something. Okay. Might, it might be actually coming out soonish. Soonish? Soonish. Uh, no release date. Two. Not later. Soonish. Soonish. <laughs> All right. Uh, next one. Witcher three. I have not played any of the Witcher games, so I don't know anything. I'm... That's the one um, where he's uh, searching for. He's hunting a, a griffin. Yeah. Yeah. That one. I, I I thought it was interesting. It looked interesting. This uh, Witcher has always been a game that I wa- uh, well Witcher one and two. Uh, that's on the list of things I want, uh, games I want to play, but I just don't get around to playing. Okay, um, you know that um, kind of like skill thing where he has the vision where he sees the blood. Right, the tracking. It reminded me of that one game we played with the wolf. I'm actually just adding that. Uh, are, uh, you? Yeah. are you? Are you? You should probably post it then. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> well, it, re- it reminded me of that, yeah. so I'm like, right. yeah. Uh, impressions. Uh, well, have you played any of Witcher games? No, no. Well, I'm in the same boat as you. I, I haven't played, you know, like all, like well, any of the Witcher games. But this one looked like it had a really, a, like, unique story. It had a really, like, strong. Yeah, supposedly the story's you know, good. The game gameplay's good for the first one. I don't know about the second but, one. But you know, th- just watching this trailer, I would definitely play this one. Yeah. From you know, not I like, I like playing the other ones. I was yeah. play this. Yep. Uh, that's basically and it's a griffin. It's not a dragon. Yeah. It, yeah. looked, it looked interesting. I liked the gameplay. It reminded me of Skyrim. That's, yeah. that's the only thing I have to say. It's pretty yep. much like these demonic type of creatures that are out. Like, I saw this deer that looked kind of weird. Yeah. All right. So we, we just got a few games left. So let's just keep going for them. Okay. All right. So next one. Phantom Dust. This wild card thing. Do you guys have any idea what Phantom Dust is? No. It came out on the original Xbox, the not Xbox 360, but the one before that. The original Xbox. <laughs> yeah, the original. Yeah. The first Xbox, Xbox One. No. But yeah. No. And the, the Xbox One, the new one, is Xbox 3 to me. I don't care what people say. Okay. That's. I was anyway, going to say, no, it's the Xbox 720, but... Okay. Yeah. Well, that too. That would be that a better name. <laughs> right? That would be a better name. It's now so confusing. I don't like it. Yeah. That's the first thing on my... To fix Xbox. Anyway, uh, Phantom Dust is supposedly a game that was really popular, but somehow no one remembers the game now that mm-hmm. they announced this remake or sequel or reboot. Well, there's now a three, so there must be a two. Indeed. This is Phantom Dust. Right, right, right. Oh, this is Phantom Dust, not Witcher 3. There's only been, I guess, one game on the Xbox One. Oh. You think you're I, all... I thought I Not should. indeed. Not indeed. <laughs> Scratch that. So, I don't know, because I'd never played the game. It looked interesting, the trailer, I was kind of wondering where it was going, and then mm-hmm. it turned into a wizard duel thing in New York City that was post apocalypse kind of thing. I don't really know. I'm confused. Oh, that one. Oh, yeah, now you know what we're talking about as we're leaving. Yeah, the one with the... Yeah, yeah the, the one with the chick. Yeah, okay. That's all I remember. Moving on. <laughs> uh, Division. Gameplay of Division. Division was announced last e, uh, E3. It was mm-hmm. their Ubisoft's closer... So the way Ubisoft has been going, uh, whenever they finish a show, they do like a one more thing. And mm-hmm. the first, like three years ago, it was Watch Dogs. Everyone was talking about Watch Dogs. Right. It was the, it stole E3 entirely. Last year was Division. Everyone was freaking out at Division. Right. So th- they showed more Division off. Uh, you guys probably didn't see last E3 of Division. No. No. Uh, it's kind of a... Uh, Someone sp- uh, spread a virus over like some currency. 
And then, oh, wait, I did see this. Yeah. Yeah. And then the whole world got sick, and then slowly everyone died. And yeah, you're with like a group every, of guys like in New York City or something like that. You're kind of like a rebel uh, elite yeah, group yeah. or something fighting against the system or the going after the terrorists and trying to save the world after the world's right. dead and burned. Yes, I did see that. So That was actually pretty cool. Like, I like It's it. interesting. I'm yeah. very interested in it. Uh, we can talk more about the Division in Ubisoft press conference okay. because it's been too oh. hot. And I'm worried about my monitor melting. It's getting hot in here. Uh, it's a thick of all you could. So, no, please uh, don't. Next game from Platinum Games is Scalebound. It's where you have a pet dragon and you fight monsters and do things and you can have Dre beats. And Dude. that's basically the game. Wait, Scalebound. What's not good about yeah, having a pet that was dragon? One, it was kind of like a goofy trailer where. It wasn't really goofy. It was well, like action packed. But the, the only thing that threw me off was Dre beats. Everything was medieval and stuff, and then you just have like Dre beats. Or the headphones. Thing. But, like, the main character was kind of, like, goofy, you know. Yeah. In a way. yeah. Was he goofy? Yeah. I didn't, really, no, I didn't uh, strike he me wasn't goofy. goofy. He just, I don't know. I, like, he was trying to like act. Like a smartass? Kind of like that. I just, yeah. you, you know, but. Uh, it's Monster Hunter. You fight monsters, you have a monster, and it's like Pokemon, but extreme. Steroid thing. And he has, like, dragon skin. Yeah, he has, like, a dragon. Dragon skin. skin. Well, it's got scale bound, so I guess I'm the to the title. Yeah. Down, Moving on, uh, Crackdown. Have you guys played any of the Crackdown games? Uh, I think, wasn't it, there wasn't were, the first one free for the Xbox 360 or something at some time? Yeah, there, it was, one of the Crackdowns was free, I think I told you guys to download it. Yes. Well, I never played it. Well, I downloaded it. I Have you played it? Downloaded it. it, it. Yeah. Wait. Yeah. I did see the trailer for a bit, LA, what's it about again? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> no? Uh, it's the, well, the trailer. I think you have vehicles and you can customize them and then. It's a very, it's like. Dead, it's Deadpool meets GTA. It's yeah, I something like that. That's yeah, basically it. Something well, like in this E3, well, do you know what you E3 trailer we're talking about this year? No. They they drove a truck off the building with the strap of tons of dynamite, and then they shot it, and then it blew into a tire, uh, Mogul's headquarters thing. Yes, I and think the guy so. Was, it blew up a building. Yeah. I think so, yeah. That uh, one. Yeah. Okay. Anyway. Uh, it split... This is also there has been two Crackdown games and then th this is just Crackdown, so it could so, be a reboot. So uh, <laughs> there's Xbox One all over again. <laughs> it's just it's like well it's just reboot. It seems like uh, I like I haven't followed any of Crackdown. Well, games. it should have been like Crackdown HD or yeah. something. Uh, so and that's basic, basically where they ended it uh, for the Xbox press conferences. Yeah. Uh, we'll we'll come back with our impressions of like at the end of like what we think of each pref. Perfect ground friends, like mm -hmm, in the whole mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right now, we're gonna take a break because we need to get some drinks, get some beer, and stuff. So we'll be back with more of E3 yeah. discussion. Yeah. Yeah.